Okay, now, so this is what we have to make. So first of all, I'll make the case over here. Okay, so it's shaped as this. Okay, so I will use the pen tool. Uh, initially, there was something somehow wrong with the pen tool. So let me see it again. That's the case we have to make. So it has to be somehow like this. Uh, I'll start from here. Yes. Here and take it down and come here. There we go. And try to make it as accurate as possible. Obviously, it has to be as accurate as possible. Due to some settings, I was as unable to click. So here we go. We have this right. Um, as you can see, it's a bit thick. So since I don't really have the exact, so it is. I'll just make it four, and we'll change the color to uh, something like this. Okay, and I'll go into effect. I'll make it color by itself. I'll just press so back first. Uh, okay. So we've got something like this, right? Because it looks like it canceled the board. Okay, so we we may we have somehow made this. Okay, now we obviously you can see it's not visible, but we have these calibrations. So how do we make these calibrations? So first I'll make this part of the derogations. Okay. So go. Now for that, what I'll do is uh on, I'll come to the side. Okay, and I'll make this around the rectangle. I'll set this by 19 to exactly. Right. And uh, what we'll do is we need to replicate this. So I'll come into transform and we'll set this like 19. And I have always 15. So I counted them. They're like 15 of these previously I did count them. Okay, so you can see where it is. This is what I have. But before I do that, I think so we should set this to one, the border. Okay, that was pretty thick. So transform uh, 19, and we need 15 of these. Let's press OK. Uh, again, I think so the color should have been, I hope I can change it now. Yes, I did. Now, so this is one object. So I, I, what I just want is uh, to convert it into expand. I want to expand this overall, OK? Now, uh, what we'll do is, so somehow I just need to reduce the size of this a bit. I'll bring this here. Oh, hold on. Okay. Uh, maybe we have to just right. Uh, what we can do is, since if I'm unable to fit this here exactly, uh, so, right. Uh, we could use over here. Uh, there was this free distort. It's a very amazing too. So come to free distort. I'll, I'll tell you again. You come to effect. You will find over here from in, in, in transform free distort. So but you just have to be very accurate. You have to just click here for C. Uh, there you go. So it will come here, and this needs to come here. So. Same with I'll do this. Okay. And this seems to be fine. I think so. Uh, we can probably just here. Right. And probably we could just bring this a bit more over here. That's okay. So you see, just by good estimate, I was able to. So I could arrange this. 
uh, again. Yeah, you see again, uh, it's not setting up. So using your object selection tool or your, or your curvature tool would not help. Uh, the best approach again would be that I go back over here on the field store. Okay. And somehow, I don't know why I did it. Fine. Okay. Just one second. I should not show in again, by the way. I didn't click on reset, by the way. Anyway. So. Oh, so that was too much. There we go. So we have something like this. Now, what we need to take care of is uh, that this fill that we have, let me move it down. Technically, this fill has to be of white color. Right? So now it is. Now, since we have made this, we have somehow made this. Okay. Uh, it will look much more appropriate once we are done with a bit more work. Uh, still, 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 sorry. Uh, it's not very accurate. So, I to do it again. Uh, okay, what we could do is, we could use is uh, the arch tool, okay? Uh, not that much, just a bit, just a bit. This is too much. Uh, let's reduce it. But this this will certainly help us. There we go. So you see, it's it's a lot more better. Uh, fine, fine. Uh, just a bit towards this side. Up. Uh, let's see. It's somehow not quite perfect placed. Okay. Uh, from the below, I'm so sorry. This time to be very accurate. So just one last time, one last time. Uh, this was too much, so I would just somehow. This was fine. Uh, it, it's very, very sensitive, by the way. So this has to be extended. Extended. So now what we'll do is we have to make the other part. So C control V.
and we need to do is we need to make um this this uh, thing uh, if i zoom in i can show you. it's not very clear but i can just show you that uh, we have this purple thing so it's it's uh, somehow you no know, not very tidy but fine it's something like this i'll just show you so i can use the shape builder tool uh, just click here click here You can just use as a tangle to you. It's not very clear. Obviously, I don't have the it's just like this. You know, from here, right. so now and make this. I don't know exactly what color it is, but I'll just leave it this way. Okay. So this is what we have, as you can see, okay, right? Uh, so that's one object. What we'll do is somehow what I did was I will copy it. So anyway, no problem. Uh, we'll just bring this over here. Uh, remember to make uh, uh, copies of the, these. Sorry, it was not supposed to be this way. It was supposed to be control X. And you're supposed to pay control V. You are supposed to paste it on it. So once you paste it on it, you will have something like this, just like the way we have it in the picture, right? There we go. Uh, don't worry, it'll turn out to be exactly the same. Now we have to make the topic. So remember to save them separately. I'm not doing that. I hope you know what I'm saying. So I'll just uh, select this, I'll put it over here. Okay. Now we have to make the topic. So how to make the topic? Well, I could use again. So here we go. I could use some gray color. Okay. So like here, right. And if I really want to smoothen this up, I could use over here is the smooth tool. And where I, I feel it has to be a bit more smooth, I would smooth it with the smooth tool. It's really nice, uh, makes things a little bit better. So that's my smooth tool. Okay. And what we need to do is now, uh, we need to make those, uh, I need to make these, 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 these are made. Again, it's not very clear, but I'll try to make them whatever they are. So here we go. It was something like. Maybe something like this. Okay, that's the first shape. Okay, I'll just put it here. And. And then we have something like this shape. I could even color them right away. First, let me make the shapes. Okay, so the second one is something like, okay. Now 
I'm sorry, two long people like this. Okay, anyway, that was the second one that I have. And then I have to make is the last one, this one. So again, what I could do is I could obviously use This is what I have. Uh, let's use a gradient. So if I use a gradient, it will work this way. You have to click on the color. Uh, use that color. You have the color, use a gradient. You don't get the gradient, change the color. You get the gradients. So it has to be this way. Okay, fine. Uh, <clears throat> okay, if you want the gradient to go in the middle, you can do something like this. Okay, fine. And uh, probably what I could do the same thing with this one. There's a gradient. I could do the same thing with this one. Uh, use a gradient. Uh, all of these uh, will not have an outline. So I'll pencil out the outline of all these. I'll make it transparent. So what do we have? Uh, we need to have is now. Uh, obviously, I placed somehow here. I'm going to place this here. Uh, I place this somehow over here. Okay, where is it? Yeah, this was supposed to be. Uh, yeah, I wish I could. We can try to uh, move the shape a little. Okay. So we have this as well. Now what we need to do is we obviously need to place a stopping on top of this, obviously. So you save it separately again. Remember to do that. Uh, let me just press control minus because I really don't need to zoom in a bit. So here we go. We have this. Uh, and that is this so this technically is at the top of this but one second one second one last thing that i need to do is uh let me just take it down this needs to be a bit up okay i'll tell you why so there we go there we go uh, So this is what we have made. Uh, hopefully you got the point, right? 